Okay, so um, a year from today, uh, September 5th, 2010, I went to my first 30 Seconds to Mars show. <sighs> like, what? That seems like so long ago. Oh my, and then I, so I've seen them three times in one year, and it, on, it honestly feels like it's been like a decade between like three concerts or something. It's crazy. Um, so my first Mars show was at uh, Hampton Beach Casino at um, Hampton Beach, uh, New Hampshire. It was amazing because like the, the venue was so small and so intimate, which I love. Um, what else? I met such amazing people there, um, amazing, amazing echelon. And they're the kind of people who you just you'll never forget and even though like you don't really live that close to them and you don't you don't really see them a lot like the only time that I've seen these people are at my three Mars shows because I met them at the first one and then um, my second one was in Boston and um, and I met up with them there and then at the Boston show they were like oh there's a show in um, Portland, Maine, that you should go to, and I was like, mm, I don't really know if I should go because like I was tight with money, and I knew my parents were gonna be mad at me if I go because I'd have to spend a lot of money on like gas and things. Um, but I ended up going, and it was it was exactly a week from the Boston show, so like the Boston show was on a Sunday, and then next Sunday was the Portland show. Um, so I ended up going, and oh my God, the Portland show, I can't even, it was so amazing, and like, um, Sabrina and Nick, um, their brother and sister, I met them at the Boston show, and, uh, we decided to actually go with each other to the Portland show, which was such a good idea, because they're so cool, I love them to death, um, yeah, they're, they're so amazing, I, I try and talk to them every now and then, but, um, I actually, in the middle of, so like there was a week, so like it started Sunday um, at the Boston Mars show, and I think like that Thursday I went to a My Chemical Romance show at House of Blues in Boston, and that was with Sabrina, and then um, like a couple of days later was the Sunday of the Portland show, so that was awesome, and so we went together, um, but yeah, hey Matt's here. Say hi, I'm doing my 365. Oh. Hey. <laughs> but yeah, I'm talking about my Mars shows. Oh, your mom. Yeah. But yeah, so they're amazing. Um, what did I do today? I tried to get stuff done, but <laughs> I can't fail because everything's closed because it's Labor Day. Um, why did I think of that? I'm not sure. Because, like, the, the mail sender was closed. So I'm trying to figure out that whole situation. And then the bookstore was closed, and I have to buy a book for tomorrow, but I'm sure they'll be fine. Uh, what else? It's hot. It's humid. It's gross. We're just kind of sitting here chilling, doing absolutely nothing. What movie should we watch tonight? Um, well, we'll be good to... Basically, for the past three nights, we've had a Jared Leto marathon. So the first night, we watched Mr. Nobody. And then the second night, we watched Highway, which was so good. Um, and then last night, we watched Panic Room, because Matt hasn't seen it yet. So we had to watch it. So what should we watch tonight? Well... We could do... We could do Requiem, Fight Club. Um, I don't know if I have anything else. So I'm not some disembodied voice I'll come over here. It's us. We can do rap, we can do fight club. Uh, uh, um, what else? Wait, chapter, chapter 27. Chapter 27. We you should do that. Seen, I haven't seen that one. We should wa Oh, you haven't seen it? No. We're watching chapter 27. <laughs> it's done. It's decided. Okay. Well, that's the bug job when we swallow off that. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to go. This video is almost five minutes long. Ready? I'm going to stop it exactly when it's five minutes. Two. One. Okay, goodbye.